welcome back to Superior Sunrise. Joining me now is Shaylee Jones. Shaylee, thank you so much for being on with me today. Thank you for having me. Let's get into it. How are you and your family doing in Nebraska? We are doing great. We are so glad to have all of my siblings home. Um, due to this crazy virus, we've been able to get so much work done and help dad out with calving. We're finishing up calving. And so it's been a blessing to be all together. That's good. You know, there's always a flip side uh, to every negative, and I appreciate everybody who is looking at the positives. You were recently featured on your local news talking about the balance between working on your family's ranch while still having to finish up your school online. Let's talk about that and how you've had to make adjustments in getting everything done. Yes, so uh, some weeks I have more assignments than others, and those weeks I usually um, sadly, I'm in the house a little more often than I'd like to be, and uh, some mornings I'm, you know, doing studies, catching up on homework, and then in the afternoons I spend my time outside, you know, helping on the ranch, whether it's riding pears or, you know, fixing fence, getting ready for um, branding and for um, AIing, we're coming up on that, and so it's definitely a delicate balance between the both of those things, you know keeping up with my homework and getting my assignments turned in, but also being able to spend time outside with my family. And in your uh, news interview, you said that internet was definitely a problem for you guys, and it's a problem for everyone in rural areas. What are some things that you and your family are doing to kind of, you know, make compensations for that? Yes, yeah, so as we're all like doing online schooling, and my sister also is working uh, remotely from home here. So when one of us has like an assignment to turn in or something, we'll say, all right, everyone off the internet, one person's gonna use it now and turn in their things and then everyone can get back on and keep going with their things, you know? But uh, it's kind of been uh, a struggle in a couple of times, you know, when we're all trying to use it or on a Zoom call and it gets spotty, but we're making it through. And like you were saying earlier, you are so excited to have all of your family there together. You and your family are so close. What does it mean to you to be able to, uh, you know, work with your family every single day on y'all's cattle operation? Um, it truly is a blessing. It's so fun. Um, it's like two extra months added to summer, you know, that we get to be together and uh, ranch and keep growing really being involved in everything that we do on the ranch um, is so fun to do with my siblings and my parents along our side and we learn really valuable life lessons just being here with our parents every day and it's been a true blessing and you and your family y'all have been a uh, long time consigners with superior livestock so we always love getting to see uh, you guys out on the road and we hope to be able to see you guys soon yes fingers crossed we can see you guys out at Loveland this year. It's our family vacation every year. We love coming out and seeing our superior family and how everyone is always so nice and stays in contact with us. We just love that. We do too. We say it all the time, Superior Livestock, it is a family and you are a student at the University of Nebraska in Lincoln. Let's talk about what your plans are after college. Oh, my plans after college. Well, hopefully I can come back to the ranch someday and really just, um, help the ag industry grow in any way that I can. I'm an ag business major down at the university and I just love to um, be able to show the world, you know, what the ag industry is all about and definitely help that grow. Well, Shaylee, we appreciate you being on with us today. Uh, stay safe out there and uh, thank you for everything you and your family are doing. Thanks so much for having me today.